Welcome to Selling with Your iPad. Don't let your iPad be a distraction. The iPad can be very engaging. It can also be a distraction at the point of sale because people are largely still unfamiliar with the device. Here's our top three tips for preventing your iPad from being a distraction at the point of sale. First, organize your apps for easy access. Let me show you how this works. Hold down an app until it wiggles. Then drag it on top of another app to group them together. Then simply label the group for effective use. And this helps with our second tip, which is to create a clean, professional home screen. You don't want your screen to look like this. A clean home screen will be less distracting so your customer can focus on your product and you and not on the iPad. We suggest moving all your business groups and most used apps to the dock. Then move all your other apps, including your games, off the home screen so that it looks very clean like this. Our final tip is to practice multi-apping. As salespeople, we all know that we need to prep before walking to sale to gather names, collateral, pricing, whatever we need. Now you need to prep your iPad in exactly the same way. Before walking into the sales call, take a minute to open up the apps you might use. For example, Keynote and Good Reader. Now, when you double tap the home button, you'll see these two apps are first and second in the hidden dock, making them extremely accessible. You can also double tap from within an app. Like in this example, where I'm transitioning from a PDF to a PowerPoint using Goodreader and Keynote. The benefit is you have an easy, smooth transition between apps and your sales collateral. In summary, less distraction means more focus on you and your products, making your iPad a more effective selling tool. So thanks for joining us, and we hope these tips help you sell your products more effectively with your iPad.